Hi guys, this is Abid. Textures plays a beautiful role in fabric painting. Hot wax create amazing visual textures with the help of different materials. For example, different sizes of the brushes, wires, sponge, dry grass, blocks, and net. In this video, I tried to create textures in very simple way. You can use these textures in your batik painting. You can find different materials from your surroundings and utilize them in your batik art. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do it and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Let's start the video. I am using newsprint sheet for this texture. Fold the sheet two or three times. Twist it and roll the sheet as you can see in the video. Dip the roll in the hot wax and take impressions on the fabric. Do not dip more than half inch in the hot wax. After complete the impressions, stretch the fabric on the wooden frame. I have made a video on how to stretch the fabric on the wooden frame. Find the link in this video description. Apply the paint with sponge on the surface of the fabric, but if you are working on the large size fabric, apply the water on the fabric first, then apply the paint. Let the fabric dry after painting. When the colors dry out, remove the wax from the fabric. I have already made a video on it. You can get the link from this video description. Wax is removed now. Iron the batik piece 4 to 7 minutes. I used iron fixed silk paints in this video. If you are using silk dyes, iron the fabric according to the suggested video and follow the instructions given on the dyes label. Thumbs up if you like my video and don't forget to subscribe if you visit my channel for the first time. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Stay happy. Goodbye.